Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Frances. I am a full-time reseller on many platforms and they'll all be listed below in the description on this video. Um, welcome if this is your first time here. Welcome back if you've watched before and if you already subscribe. Um, we are here today. It's Sunday. Happy Sunday, everybody. Um, I'm here today with a America's Thrift Supply um, name brand purse box. Um, it was just delivered. I have been struggling getting new inventory. Um, normally I post unboxings from ThreadUp. I like to get the coach rescue box. I like to get the name brand rescue box, name brand handbag rescue box. I get America's Thrift Supply. Um, I sometimes shop the Goodwill blue box jewelry. Um, if you like that kind of content, please like and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. I made it to 500 subscribers this weekend, y'all. I'm so excited. I still got, I got 500 more to go, but hey, I'm halfway there. You got to celebrate the little things, right? Um, so today, if you like this kind of content, that's what I was going to say. If you like this kind of content, I take you thrifting with me. Um, I haven't been thrifting much lately because I had a grandbaby. We had a tropical storm. Debbie, um, just a lot, a lot of things going on. Um, hopefully in the next week or so I can take you thrifting with me again. Um, my husband and I also bid on storage units and we win storage unit through the auction and I take you on, take you to that with us. I show you what I got. I do a thrifting fail short video. Like if I see something crazy out in the wild, I'll do a little short video on that. Um, but basically I'm here just to have fun, just to, um, is something new for me this year, YouTube being a YouTuber in 2024. So I'm giving it a go so far. It's been great. I've made a lot of, a lot of new friends. Um, everybody is so nice out here. Um, so this is a special video today because I just got this box and I just, I, I gotta open it. I can't wait. I can't, some, some of the YouTubers out here that do these boxes, they say, oh, I've had this box for months or months and I got stacks of boxes. Not me. I can't wait. So, um, I do sell from my video. Um, I'll just kind of wing it on prices. I may be losing, you know, it might be something that I could get a whole lot of money for, but as my subscribers, I offer you a better price from the get-go. That way I can get the item moving and I don't have to list it, take pictures. Um, also, if you're new here, I fidget with my hair a lot. I pinned it up today. This week is hair week, so I need to get my roots done. I need to get a trim. I don't know about y'all, but when I go to the hairdresser, she does like this deep conditioning on my hair and it just makes it feel so good. And it, it lasts usually all the way up until about a week before I have to go. And then my hair starts feeling dry and fried again. But anyway, um, I'm going this week to get my hair done. Um, and hopefully I can take y'all thrifting with me. So anyway, I'm going to, I'm going to offer prices on these bags. Um, the way that I need you to order or let me know that you want one is I need you to email me in the, if you look in the comments, I will pin at the very top, my email address, email me the bag that you want. Um, please check that same comment box because under the email address, I'll have sold. So if anything's already sold, I will list it there. And that way you won't waste your time, you know, emailing me. I want this bag when it's already sold, but that's okay. If you do, I'll just have to tell you, sorry, it's sold. Um, I invoice through PayPal. It's, I do PayPal and Venmo. PayPal seems to be working, um, really good for me since I've started selling on YouTube. Um, I ship out the next day, same day, next day. Well, I can't ship out today cause it's Sunday, but I will ship out tomorrow. Um, you know, I, I usually the same day or next day is what I'm trying to say. And I, and I try to find the cheapest shipping for you. Um, you know, I'm not out to make money on shipping. That's for sure. I just want to, you know, get my money back from these boxes and, and share some of these great bags, these pre-loved bags with you. And, you know, I'm all about saving things from going to the landfill. So this box came from Birmingham, Alabama. And again, it's America's Thrift Supply. That's the website. You go on there. 
This particular box comes available on Friday at 5 Eastern, 4 Central, and then you can do the, the other the other, I don't know, I don't know all those time, time zones, but anyway, my, I'm in South Carolina, which is Eastern, so at five o'clock on Friday, these come available, and let me tell you, just like anything else, it is almost impossible to get one. Soon as I'm, I mean, I'm right there on the website, and soon as it comes available, by the time I click it and get it in my cart and get ready to check out, sometimes I already get the notification, um, this item's already sold out, so normally, in the past, I've been able to get one and then go right, turn right around because they won't let you add two to the cart. Turn right around and get another one. This Friday, I couldn't even get one. I mean, it was like 5.02 and they were gone. So anyway, good luck if you're trying to get them. They have other boxes too. They have jewelry boxes. They have band t-shirt box. Um, I haven't gotten that one yet. I'm thinking about getting that one um, because... You notice I have on nice earrings today that match my top. I do on my Instagram, my Instagram handle is Sassy Mingo. I do a earring of the day series. And a couple weeks ago, I did um, band shirts, my band t-shirts. And I tried to, you know, match an earring with that, that t-shirt. And then I add a song from that band. Um, so if you like jewelry, if you like earrings, follow me on Instagram. Um, I also put on there new a lot of new items that I've thrifted that are, are for sale. And, you know, if you let me know you're a subscriber and you see something on my Instagram page that you want to purchase, I will give you a much better deal than I would if it was, you know, if you went to Poshmark, eBay, or Macari to get it. This box was $49.99. Let's see. Yeah, $49.99. I had a 15% code. So I got a little bit off of that. There is $9.99 shipping. There's no tax. So that's um, that's the price of the box. And I'm supposed to have five pieces in here. I get it mixed up with the um, the thread up box because the thread up box is four purses and one accessory. This is just five pieces. So I'm hoping to see some color. I like color. I like bright colors. Um, I don't like to get a bag, a box full of um, brown and black bags, even though they sell. All right, y'all. First off, I'm going to have to put this box down here because it's wanting to flap in my way. We have a backpack. We have a Ferrelli, F -I for, for, Ferrelli, I don't know. Um, it is this nice Cognac Brown. I think that's how you call it. It has adjustable straps on the back. This is our bottom. I always like to show the bottom and the corners. I'm not sure if this bag is leather. Oh, we even got a pen. We got a pen and we got a movie ticket. I'm always getting movie tickets in these. What did they go see? Oh, it doesn't say. Baton Rouge. This came from Baton Rouge. Or they were in Baton Rouge. But anyway, this is our... Oh, this is nice. Y'all, the last box I got a dime. This one I got 50 cent. Look, I'm already, I've already made a little bit of my $50 back. Okay, so this, I'm going to say this is faux leather. This is what the inside looks like. It is very clean. It may have been used once or twice. Um, not knowing. Yeah, this is, you do have the little top handle here. Let me show, we do have gold, a gold zipper. You have a little fringe here. You have a little fringe here. And this is the inside. You have two slips and a zip pocket. And then over here, you have two more slips. So this is a cute little backpack. Um, there is the name on the front. I'm not showing, we have a pocket on the back, nothing in there. So again, this is our um, first item. It's okay, I don't, I really don't think this is leather. I think it's faux leather, vegan leather, whatever you wanna call it. 
Um, and I'm gonna say $18 for this backpack. 18 for the Fiori. I'm keeping the 50 cent. Ferrelli. What, what did I say? Ferrelli for, for um, $18. Okay. That is our first bag. Our second bag is, I've seen this name brand in lots of boutiques. It's Chahala, Chala, Chahala. We got something in here too. Oh, that's the silica pack. So this may be brand new. This is, oh yeah, we still have the plastic thing on here. We have two removable straps. So let me get this thing zipped up and get this figured out. So, oh, it's a turtle. Look at this. Is this not adorable? This is like a little, um, a little crossbody bag, great for travel, great for going to the movies, going shopping, when you don't, going thrifting, when you don't, when you need your hands available. So I have the iPhone 13 Pro Max, which is a pretty big phone, as you can see. This is the case. Let's do the test and see if she fits. And she fits and she zips. So this is the back of your bag. It is a black pebbled leather. We got all kind of colors going on here. So this is black pebble. This is brown leather. And then we have this green, almost suede, where your turtle is. And look, look how stinking cute he is. He's embellished with all these little bead, with this beading. Um, He's got a button right here on his back and another little button right there. This is the bottom. Y'all, I'm going to say this is new without tags. Um, this is in excellent condition. And as you see, you have a little strap, which is adjustable. Is, and then you have the crossbody strap that is adjustable. And the straps... There's no sign of wear whatsoever. It also comes with this little starfish and a flower charm. So I'm gonna say 25 on this. 25 on the turtle crossbody Chahala. Ch I don't. I'm. I'm. I'm sure I'm butchering that name. But anyway, this is so cute, y'all. I've um. I'm familiar with this brand because um, there's a store at the beach where my friend lives and they sell a lot of this brand. They sell like the keychains. Matter of fact, I bought her. She she likes mermaids. I like flamingos and she likes mermaids. So we're the old tacky women that like those kind of things. But anyway, she I got her a mermaid keychain from this company and it is so, she said it's her favorite keychain ever. She keeps her golf cart her little storage unit and her house key on it. She carries it all the time and her car key. So she says it's big enough that she doesn't lose it in her purse. And anyway, I, and it was from this same brand and I bought it at that shop at, in Surfside Beach. And it was pretty expensive. It was probably more than $25 just for the keychain. So anyway, you're getting this great, great little crossbody for 25 today. Again, I try to, you know, I, I try to be very fair. The first person that emails me says they want it. I'm going to invoice you right away. If you pay, it's yours. Um, I don't like to hold items. That's kind of got me in a little, not a bind, but made me end up losing a sale. And then the other person that wanted ended up said they went online and found one and bought that. So when I came back to him and said, hey, the first person ever paid, if you wanted it, it's yours. And she's like, oh my gosh, I wish I'd have known that. I've already found one online and it was twice as much, but I wanted the bag so bad. So I'm not holding anything. Um, once I invoice you, you know, I'm gonna say, tw if you hadn't paid by 24 hours, the item's going to, to the next person that wants it. Okay, gotta be. I gotta be fair and I gotta make my money back on these box. All right, so, so far, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna be ordering this again, but I, I don't know. 
So our next bag is a very large, I think this is coated canvas, Calvin Klein tote. It is this, it's got the signature pattern. The bottom is brown, and I believe this is all coated canvas. The inside is suede. This is the bottom. Let me get this bag straight. They, they really crunch them up in this bag. Um, so anyway, we have gold hardware. This, this is our bag. These are our shoulder straps. It is not a crossbody. These straps are removable though. So if you do have a longer strap, um, there's Calvin Klein embossed on the gold hardware. This is your bottom. There's your corner. There's your corner. Here is the back. It looks, seems to be in excellent condition. The inside just has a little bit of fuzzies in it. So just need a little vacuuming out. Or uh, um, let me turn this bottom thing around. There we go. That's the inside. See what I mean? The inside is a suede. But then this feels like that coated canvas. The straps feel leather. Um, very nice. Calvin Klein. There you go right there. Large large tote. There is no closure at the top. Well, I say that, but you know what? I think there's a magnet. Yes, there is a magnet, a magnet that will close the top, but there's not a zipper or a snap. It's just a magnet. And she's in really good condition, just a little wipe down. And I'm going to say for the Calvin, let's say $30. $30 for this big, big, large Calvin Klein tote that is in excellent condition. I'm not showing any wear on the hardware. Let me show you the handles. The handles, there's, you know, no fraying, no, no cracks. Okay. Oh, we got one little spot right there, but I probably can wipe that off. So there you go. That is number three. Number four, well... Not, I'm not sure about this bag, y'all. Yeah. Oh, this bag is new, or it still has its stuffing in it. This is an Agner. This is an Agner bag. Look at this. I, I, I'm from the South, and we always called it Agner. I don't know the proper name, but there's your logo. This is like a um, black fabric, tweed, not tweed, it's not straw, I don't know what it is, now this definitely is leather, all right, so here's your bottom, we have feet, there's a corner, there's a corner, this is a very cute bag, we have silver hardware, you have this little leather, leather strap that goes, it's almost like a, um, a belt buckle, it is, it actually is adjustable. So I guess you could cinch the bag in. I don't know, that's really neat, but it's like an Agner belt around it. It doesn't go all the way around the back, but it's, as you see, it starts on the sides. You have these little leather sides right here. This is what the side looks like, this. These are our handles. And again, the stuffing was still inside, it snaps. You have this black, white, and gray pattern on the inside. The inside is clean. I'm not seeing, yeah, this, this is new. We still have the little thing that I don't know if anybody ever filled those out. Yeah, we have a couple of those in here. So we have a zipper pocket and it zips. We also have like a little card organization thing going on here, like this. This right here is for your ID, and then you have some card slots. And then on this side, you have one slip, and then you have an elastic slip. Um, very nice bag. Very nice. It came with the stuffing. 
So I don't know. I'm not I, I'm not seeing anywhere whatsoever on her. She is a top handle bag, but I do see hooks in here for a crossbody. So the crossbody is not here. So if you have a brown or black leather crossbody strap, it will, you know, you can use it on her. She is so cute, y'all. Perfect bag to go start the fall and the winter with her. Um, I'm really not sure what this material is though. You can see it up close. See? And I'm gonna ask 30 for her, for the Agner. I know some of y'all are probably out there laughing at me for calling it that because I watched one lady and she called it a Janair or something like that. I, I said, oh my goodness. I grew up my whole life calling it Agner. All right, so it looks like we have two more pieces. So that's one, two, three, four. So it looks like we got six pieces. Now the next bag, I wouldn't consider a name brand. And that's probably why we got an extra piece. That's what they do sometime. Y'all, and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna tell you if you're new watching this, and what I'm used to getting in the America's Thrift Supply is usually like Dooney and Burke, um, Coach, Michael Kors, um, Fossil. So I'm not sure about this box, but that is the gamble you take. That's the gamble you take when you buy these mystery boxes. You don't know what you're gonna get. Um, my last America's Thrift box had some Kate. Oh, Kate Spade is an O. You usually get a lot of Kate Spade. And some people say they get a lot of Vera Bradley, but I ain't, I've never gotten Vera Bradley. But anyway, yeah, what I was going to say is my last box from America's Thrift Supply, I had the Michael Kors and the Kate Spade. I had like three Kate Spade in that box, but they were all damaged. So uh, this past Friday, when I ordered this one, I said, no the Friday before, I said, you know what, I'm gonna give him one more chance. This bag, this box is better because I'm not seeing any damage, but like that first bag, I don't know. I, I, I'll I have to look it up. Maybe, maybe it's something I don't know about. The second little bag was good. The Agner's good. Calvin Klein is okay, but this next one is Rosetta. I'm not really sure where, where that's sold. I see it all the time in thrift stores. And for the thrift store price, I wouldn't pick it up because normally my thrift store per, well, I'll say Goodwill, my Goodwill's purse prices are $6.99. Um, but here we have a Rosetta. Yo, and I have, there's all these little sticks in this box. I don't know what these are. There's like four or five or six of those things. What are those? So anyway, this bag actually feels like leather. It is, it's, it's a gunmetal, gunmetal gray. There's your Rosetta, Rosetta. It's a crossbody. I'm thinking it's leather. It feels like leather to me. This is your bottom, it's your corners. They look to be in excellent condition. This is the back. This is the front. You have a little zip pocket. And you have a snap pocket. I might better look up Rosetta. Maybe it's sold at Kohl's. Um, the inside is black. Let me see here. This will tell me what it's made of. No, it's not leather. It's man-made material. 100% man-made material. So it's not leather. It's faux leather, it's vegan leather. Um, uh, Rosetta, I don't really know what the difference between faux leather and vegan leather is, if there's actually. So anyway, um, you have a slip, you have a zip pocket, the top zips. She's in excellent condition. Let's check out the strap. The strap is in good condition. It is adjustable. So it is a crossbody. And I'm gonna say 15 for the Rosetta. She's a gunmetal. 
gunmetal gray, another great color for the fall and winter. Cute. So that was five. Now we have six. Oh, oh, we have two more. Or do these go together? What is this? What is this? This is... Okay. I have two of these and I don't know what they are. Do these go on a purse? Is this one of those purses that you buy the base and then you put these on there? I don't know. There's a name. Mishi, M-I-C-H-E. This one is an off-white and it has this silver metallic flower embroidered on it. This is what the back looks like. They both have feet, so it must it must go on the bag like that. I remember something like this back in the day. And then this one is black croc. I'm going to have to research this because I don't know anything about this that I don't have the the purse. I just have the covers. This is a black crocodile with this big gold buck, silver buckle. Silver hardware, silver feet. Cute concept. I just don't know if anybody, if anybody has this bag. Let's say $10 each. If you buy both, I'll give them to you for 15. <laughs> I don't know, I've got to do research on these. So there you have it. There is the America's Thrift Supply five piece name brand handbag box. And you know what? It may not be, it might just be handbag name. I know it says name brand. I know it does. So anyway, let's just do a recap. We got these two purse covers is what I believe by Mishi, 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 Mishi. I don't know. I don't know. 15 for both or 10 for each, if you just want one. Um, we have the Rosetta Gunmetal Crossbody Faux Leather, 15. We have the Agner Stinking Cute Bag. This is the, this and the Turtle are the game, are the, are the winners of this box. Um, I'm asking 30 for the Agner bag. I love this bag. I love it. The Calvin Klein tote, I said 30 on her because she's such a big and doesn't look like she's ever been used. Excellent condition, very large, good travel. Business tote, the Chala, Chaha, Chala, 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 25. And then the backpack, Fiori, Fiori, Anyway, y'all, I'm struggling. It's Sunday. What in the world? Um, 18. 18 for her. So, if you see something you like, shoot me an email. I was going to add some jewelry to the end or some other bags that I have that haven't sold. But I figured today, Sunday, I was just going to do a quick, quick video. Um, I still got a little bit of work to do in my office. I got some laundry to finish up downstairs. So, Thank y'all so much for watching. Again, if you like this kind of content, please subscribe. Um, leave me a comment. Tell me what you like, what you don't like. Um, give me a thumbs up. It really, really, really helps the channel. And if you do subscribe, hit the notification bell. And that way you'll be notified when I post a new video. All right, y'all have a good rest of your Sunday. And hopefully you have a good week ahead. Bye now.